what time is it and what time is it? Let me tell you now, it is the DW World Equity Times. From now onwards, every Monday, 9 a.m., 10 minutes is all you need to spend with us. And on every Monday morning, we're going to pick a powerful stock and it may come from Singapore markets, Malaysia markets, Hong Kong markets, China markets, US or UK markets. And we call this the OTOP 1910. One target, one purpose, Monday, 9 a.m. and 10 minutes. Be forewarned, we are not recommending any stocks, but it could be a very powerful stocks or very potential commodity counter for that particular week. So stay tuned and what you're going to do next is every Monday, 9 a.m., just log on and watch us. Stay tuned and be our fan. I'll be right back. All right there, today I got three good news. All right, one, two, three good news to share with all of you. And of course, first of all, this is the OTOP 53, all right, 53 episode for the week, 9 August year 2021. And because this is OTOP 53, that means we have passed the one year calendar. We are moving on to the second year of sharing on every Monday morning, 9 a.m. Singapore time. And secondly, 9 August today is the National Day of Singapore and we are all celebrating this good holiday at home well and I'm still sharing uh, this old talk with you guys despite this is a holiday all right and the third good news is this week all right for old talk 53 we're gonna share something very different okay it is not a stock not a FXCFD but it is a crypto all right a cryptocurrency so if you want to know what is that stay tuned with us for the next 10 minutes and before i start don't forget to like us and like and start to share all right share with all the people around you okay let us um, do a very quick run through all right on what happened last friday if you would have if you had followed the market on last friday the u.s job report uh, was pretty strong okay and the payroll was um, much higher than the expectation which uh, actually put uh, Dow Jones and S&P to a new fresh record high upon closing okay and Dow Jones closed at a price of uh, 35,208 while S&P 500 closed at 4,436 all right and of course uh, with uh, a strong report um, so US dollar um, actually uh, shot up higher and that actually put gold prices down okay so this is a very quick um, revision on that but what is the crypto that we're going to talk about today has got nothing to do the, with the financial market and i just want you guys to stay tuned with us all right um if we look at this piece of news okay yes you're looking at the ethereum and what's so special about this all right on last thursday that was the 5th of august at six o'clock evening singapore time which is gmt plus eight hours all right um ethereum actually went through a new setting which we call the london hard fork okay which is a new program that was built into ethereum so what is so special about this uh hard fork that everyone has been talking about and has it really got something to do with London, all right, with UK, since we are talking about London Hard Fork. It's a full name. All right, first of all, it's got nothing to do with London, all right, and uh, what is this program that has been uh, setting into Ethereum? First of all, um, we all know that uh, since this year, January, all right, the uh, non-fungible token, in short, we call the NFT, has been rising very quickly into huge global popularity all right then everybody has been using uh, ethereum to transfer for businesses okay for transactions of uh, art and also for creating the nft and that actually uh, has um, um, increased tremendously on the transaction and brought up the gas fee around the world so by putting this london hard for um, setting into the ethereum program number one okay what does that mean it means like if you are traveling on highway all right this new hard fork program is like increasing more lanes on the highway and let all the traffic travels faster 
and also smoother because we have more lanes so instead of having just four five six lanes for example now we have 20 lanes all right so that's point number one and point number two is uh, well as the transaction speed increases and also the lane um, of the traffic transfer increases all right gas fee will be reducing so it actually enhances the usage and welcome more users around the world to continue using ethereum all right of course point number three is uh, by um, going into this transformation that will actually make ethereum uh, mining soon to be obsolete as you can read from the um, screen here all right because uh, ethereum has actually gone into the proof of stake since early this year instead of proof of uh, work all right proof of work is based on mining and proof of stake is just based on deposit and earning an interest so that actually could effectively make ethereum more popular in the coming months and right after thursday all right uh, right after this program has been set in we have seen a run up uh, in ethereum prices and also on um, all the cryptos prices across the board and this is exactly where we are coming up next all right so based on uh, this price bought here which is a live price if you are saying bitcoin is uh, has bitcoin i remember last week was still trading at about thirty thousand us dollars to 32 33 and he has gone up shot up ten thousand us dollars per unit all right that's about 30 percent and um ethereum was trading at about two thousand two thousand one hundred us dollars and and, and uh, likewise the unit price of ethereum has gone up to two thousand nine hundred sixty dollars which is close to three thousand dollars all right and the rest were also following okay if we would look at the uh, all these like cardano ripple okay uh, personally i don't like dogecoin okay like um, if you are looking at polka dot it was trading at like 12 13 14 dollars just about more than a week ago so where are we actually expecting ethereum to go um higher this week or in the near future let's take a look at the chart all right if you look at this chart here okay which is a live chart as well on uh, ethereum prices measuring in us dollar benchmark and this is the day chart all right if you look at here last thursday which is the 5th of august all right 5th of august okay after this market has been going up and if you look at this we have a lot of reason to believe that uh, the prices could be going up higher because if you look at this all this is a very progressive higher high higher high on every day okay although there could be a correction coming but i don't think that will come very fast yet all right because the ethereum market prices have broken up uh, this top which is about 2850 us dollars all right this is uh, it used to be a double top which is very strong and now the market movement the boost have conquered that and, and it could be anywhere moving up into this room at the top very quickly in another just one or two weeks which is going to start from this week so you just have to keep track on that okay well even if market were to fall back i think a downside uh, to around this 2500 us dollars per unit in ethereum is highly supported especially with the ema uh, 20 days here all right but i strongly doubt uh, market could be going back down all right to this 2500 us dollars and uh, of course if you want to take a look at a four hour chart i think well nothing much to say it's just going higher and higher and we all know that crypto is a very crazy instrument all right trade and invest accordingly to your risk appetite because high rewards uh, at the same time also uh, carry high risk for investors all right only invest or play ethereum in accordingly to you to what you deem is fit and what you think you can stomach and never never go beyond your your leveraging appetite okay but if you ask me what is the top side i'm not going to say anything on that but let me tell you personally we okay i we all of us we foresee that ethereum prices uh, is going to move into a new outlet okay outlet and uh, starting from august now perhaps it's going to last for another three to four months and it could be running all the way until end of this year so how high can it go well i'm not going to put a price here but definitely it will be it could be higher than the last high above four thousand five 
4,200 US dollars, 4,500 even higher, but we'll come to that later. As far as we are looking here, the room on the upside, okay, making a double is highly possible. Although you have to do your homework and we keep putting disclaimer on our forecast. All right, so stick to this Ethereum, do some homework and uh, only get into the water of Ethereum if you think it fits you. Okay, all right, and uh, now let's do a very quick revision on what we covered last weekend on ULE. All right, I remember that's ULE, right? Um, it's here, okay. Last week, we actually recommended um, to take a look at the uh, euros all right it was actually hovering at the top and it came down okay literally what happened was as i mentioned earlier because dollar bounced out on friday and the euro dropped so when euro currency drops always remember ule will drop by two times so we strongly suggest we have to get out of this market okay even though taking a small loss because you could actually fish the bottom at a lower price in about one or two weeks time Okay, so remember, this is a two times leveraging ETF that tracks the euro currency. So when euro is going up again, let's wait for the next and good opportunity, then we get into ULE again. All right, so this is a, a revision on ULE that we covered last week. So this week, OTOP53, don't forget, Ethereum is something that all of us, I think we should take a second look. All right, stay tuned with us. We'll come back next week on or top 54 and this is DW World Equity Time we shall see you again bye bye